are seeing a lot of pavement problems this summer on South Lakeshore Drive. Crews are repairing sections that buckled in the recent heat. So why is this particular stretch of road such an issue? We sent our meteorologist and tech genius Ed Curran out to find some answers. He's live along the drive near 47th Street. Ed. Well, I can expand on that story for you by telling you that we looked into South Lakeshore Drive and all the pavement buckles down here and found out that there are some very concrete reasons for it. The problem with South Lakeshore Drive is the same thing that makes it so durable, concrete. Good for a 50-year lifespan, it's a surface that expands when heated so it needs room to grow. If it can't expand freely, it buckles. Watch these cars hit a highway buckle in Minnesota, actually going airborne. The surface of South Lakeshore Drive is filled with expansion joints that contain a compressible sealant to keep water and debris out. Some are filled with rubber, but most contain a soft putty-like material. You have an expansion joint about every 15 feet out here. It's filled with this, a soft, pliable material that's very gummy. But in time, it becomes brittle, becomes filled with debris, and it doesn't give like it's supposed to. When it doesn't give, something else has to. This area near Oakwood popped yesterday. The concrete buckling between the joints. Crews patched it and they're working at night all week to make permanent repairs to the road and to make sure that stuff inside the expansion joints stays squishy. So the reason why we've seen so much of this this year is that the past three years, Lakeshore Drive has not been stressed very much. At this point of summer, the last three years, we've had one 90 degree day each year. This year, we've had seven of them. On Lakeshore Drive, near 47th Street, Ed Curran, CBS2 News. Rob, Erica? Okay, Ed, thank you.